All right, I'm going to show you how to find all of the media assets in your course and then export those so that you can save them in a single location. So I've got my storyline course. There's a bunch of media assets in here. First thing I'm going to do is go up to View. So I go to the View tab and then you can see here's the media library. Now in the media library, I can see that I have some tabs here so I can filter by images. Uh, characters, audio, and video. So what I'd want to do is select all of the images, for example. So I'm going to do Control A. Oops, let me select the first one. Control A. I've got all my images. So there's 40 images. And then I'm going to go to Export. And I have a demo folder here. I'm just going to go ahead and put it in my temp folder. And then if you want to, you could sort those. Like I could create a folder here and just say these are my images, right? And then have another one for my audio and video. It really doesn't matter. I'm going to go ahead and put all of those images in there. So now I can see I've got all my images inside this folder. Now at this point, I can come in here. I've got all my images. Let's say this was my uh, safety training course, right? So I'm going to go to my temp folder here and I might want to rename this safety training 101 and then that's my folder and then inside the folder I would have my images and audio and video. In another tutorial I'll show you how to rename everything so it's a single name. But the key point here is a lot of times when you're doing your production uh, you may be working in a course. You might have 10 versions of an image or you're trying this character or that character. So you have all these different iterations of what you're doing in your course. Uh, but when your course is finally done, you're going to have, you know, whatever images that you inserted in the course and that you're using. So what I like to do at the end of the course is I like to export everything that I use into a single folder. This way I know where everything's at. So if somebody says, hey, where's the images that you used in the safety course? I don't have to go dig through my production folder. I can just dig through this one folder that has everything archived. So it's an easy way to find what you're looking for for the things that you actually used. And then the other thing is it's an easy folder to share or archive if you need to.